Hello people, welcome back to follow that, I hope you're doing well. So, if you own a motorcycle club or you're interested in getting one, there is a new source of passive income that's been introduced with the new Criminal Enterprises DLC set of changes. So, you head upstairs to the bar and talk to Sandy and that is where it all starts. So notice here, there's no one in the bar. We'll come back to that later. So, you walk up and there we go, you can order a drink or resupply the bar. So if you choose to resupply the bar, then you'll get a phone call as you are moved outside. Okay, okay. And okay, okay, let's go. And then we have to drive over to this area on the west coast of the map and there is a van there and those two guys run away. Surely, surely it's not that easy. Of course not. Here we go. So as you probably know from the game, this is a biker's bar. Quite often you get a set of bikers that will ride out when you are there. And obviously you're doing a biker mission, so you know to expect trouble. So there is a damage meter, bottom right, that you need to be careful of that just checks the health of the supplies. And there, there we go. Straight away, the bikers appear out of nowhere, as they so often do with rivals in this. Now, I could just keep driving, but it's not a good idea because that van is probably going to get destroyed. So it's best to park up somewhere safe and then take out some weaponry. So I'm going to use a Mark II weapon. This one's brilliant. Incendiary bullets, which is great because it just lights them up when you've got them. Okay, so this is wave one dealt with. And then, as usual, look, when I got back in the van, that red dot appeared out of nowhere. So that, yeah. Not exactly playing fair. Now, of course, now, with the new DLC, I can just open the weapon wheel and then resupply snacks or armor just from the weapon wheel. I don't have to use the menu in anymore, the interaction menu anymore. It's a massive, important, overdue change. Right, so there's no one there, of course. Get straight back in the van, and then they will appear out of nowhere, obviously. So, there we go. What are we now? Wave two. So... Let's create some fires. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's such a good weapon, this one. Just does so, so much damage. Right, there we go. One more guy over there. Right. Are we good? Okay, we, right. So I've got back in. Wave three. Here we go again. Right. Any more? Any more for any more? Okay, is that everyone? Right. I think so. So what are we up to? With three... What? Where did that guy come from? She was not on the map. Oh dear. Okay, so I thought... No, he's, no, he's still on his bike. I thought he was on foot. So I was just going to drive away. But anyway, let's get rid of this guy. He's damaging my supplies. Go to set fire to him. Right, so that's three waves. Anyone else? I'll just top up the armor. Just in case there are any more. Okay, we're good. There we go, so three waves. Perfect, and then you just drive it back to the clubhouse, and then you're done, get a nice little payout, 30K at the moment. I don't know if that's being boosted currently with the whole set of the social club payouts, but anyway, that's what you get for now. You've supplied the bar, and now we go upstairs. Look at that, we've got some customers. One, two, three, four, I think. It's not exactly gonna be making a massive difference in Okay, so now if you go up, see Sandy, you can order a drink, or resupply the bar. If you go to resupply the bar and you've just done the mission, it will say it's already fully stocked. So that's it, you just have to wait until it's open again and you get a notification. And then you are good, so it's time to have a drink, celebrate, Job well done and a new passive income stream for the MC Club. There we go. I hope that's useful. Take care.